Welcome back. Um, it, it seems like we can work for anyone without too much difficulty. I've done one mission off screen. Because I, I got the impression that, like, we've hit the point where we're past most of the plot beats. So now they're literally just waiting for us to, like, fulfill the requirements to fight Gamaran. Which means we, we've essentially gotten to the point where I can afford to skip things, because I know a cutscene's not going to come up. Uh, and then a cutscene came up, so I'm, I'm going to redo the last thing I did on screen. Snoofers, and we know the snoof's real this time. Um, but here's, here's some post. I've been using my investigations ever since the day that snoof became... 900 years ago, I once fought someone. They were fighting over a funny necromancy about it. In the end, I defeated you. So Gamaran's the bad one who wanted to do necromancy 900 years ago, and then a good one who we don't know the name of said no, and he became a sword for about 900 years. Since then, we've guarded... Oh, we're the followers of the funny person, and we became the Asuka Ninja. He was able to extract his own soul. Oh dear. He's nothing more than a spirit. He wants a body today. I reckon this is the truth behind what's happening, alright? I know I'm just a cat now, but I reckon this is that's my theory. <laughs> but that's I forgot something very important. He's already found the soul fragment that contains the secret of necromancy. He's very strong, but if he got flesh again, it'd be problems. My soul's going scrumbly. Oh no. I'm gonna be just a normal snoofus in a moment. Well. I'm gonna go ahead and steal the fucking rice. Cause that's my job. Now that I know the secret, that you can just sort of walk up behind them and do them all off and they're none the wiser. This, this is a much less... I'm much less averse to the prospect. Um... At night, not even seen that this was a way I could go the last time because I went jumping all up and down the cliffs. Wasn't even aware I could be over here. So... You, you. I'm just sort of assuming. Anyone here who could see me, will see me. So I don't, because I don't strictly know where everyone's walking off to, do I? I can only guess. Aha, I can only guess what the Lords of Lunch have in store for you. Don't worry about the screaming, pay no attention. I wish it wouldn't, like, face me in different directions. Every day- Don't turn your lamps on, that makes me nervous. I'm simply running away with the rice! <laughs> Someone finally turned around. Do you think we've been staring at these lemon trees long enough? <laughs> Off we go. Off we go, nobody's any the wiser. If I'd not got startled, I'd have picked up all the things I saw them drop, but I got startled and so that didn't happen. Oh, hello! <laughs> you exist! There was a ghost, he got away. He must have slapped my ears so that I wouldn't hear him. Right, yeah, and, and this is what this is what caused... It didn't even give me a, like, this could be the end for me prompt. Because it's, it's not a thing I need to do, I guess. It's just a cutscene that's going to play. So I couldn't even, like, stop on that and just sink it there and just show you this. Zaji. Show you a man's knees. Oh, I've not attacked you this time. He's ready to increase his power by regaining physical form. We must strike now. Kinu told me everything. Oh, I see. I went to burn Cameron's body. Burn up this damned curse. But the body has gone. He must have it. He's got his flashback. Back. back during the next full moon. Kinu. 
I told her not to trust you with that. He is training the them, Lord into helping him. As the last Asuka, we must stop him. Let's fight him together. I'll handle this my own way. Zaji, please. I still don't entirely. Listen to me. I remember everything now. I got all my orbs I'm back. Sorry. You're sorry? You think I'm going to help you because you're sorry? You think sorry helps those who are rotting underground because of you? No. Not dead, no, just rotting. I learned the just decay sorcery. One of my earlier attempts to counteract his necromancy. <laughs> just what if I rot him faster? Oh! Follow me, and I'll kill you. Well, I'm being threatened with a blade. Oh, sad, sad knife. <laughs> just checking he's still there. I thought he might have been someone else, and that that would have made this frightfully embarrassing, because I had this whole fucking emotional back and forth with the guy. A dangerous technique. Uh, a bunch of nine compounds. I'm gonna not do it. Uh, it's not important. Not important at all. Right. Oh, hello. Goro Omi has bit the brisket. That's a shame. Well. Whoops. Can I put this fast herd into anything? What do we... You're, the... You're wrong. That that fucks up the rat. True horror benefits slightly, but it doesn't feel like the most efficient use. The soup... It's like the same problem. Trite Bevy's currently empty, so I don't, I don't even know... We've got the nasty, we've got Yars. Uh, what if I bake the fucking thing? If I bake this herb. Okay, it's it's more now, but does that oh, make you forget and be unconscious? For a bunch of reasons. There's nothing. There's nothing I can do with it at present. Maybe. Eventually. Maybe I can eventually put something in the in the pot and have a great old laugh. Mushrooms. I I really need to save up for that long grappling hook though. I, it's it's the problem. Whenever there's mushrooms on sale, you think that I need to go further when I'm going further. And then it just gets worse and worse. This is a... this is an... Well, we've, we've done rescue missions before, but we've not rescued merchants before. So we may... oh, we may fight the Taraba Ninja. We may have to fight the Taraba Ninja. I don't know that this strictly solves the problem he directly had, but we'll... We'll cross that bridge when we cross that bridge when we cross that bridge when we crock. Oh. <laughs> no one's here. Brilliant. It's brilliant that we've invented this man to gawk at you. All right. All of our missions seem to revolve around being it. You're a big man who scares me. What? You're a big man who scares me, and you need to be hurt. Large dead friend. Pick that up. And I shall throw you off the cliff to commemorate this special occasion. Hurry! Let me out! I want to be out! And I love me! Hooray! Now, um. Like, th this doesn't ask me if I want to continue the mission, so I, I need to find where you all are. I'm going to find a bunch of you before I go free and all of you because I don't want to have to fight Jeffrey Blurfus and his fucking Blurfus boys while dragging a bunch of you around with me. I don't want you getting lost, getting killed, getting me discovered. 
are you going to save me? There's two. Aren't you going to fucking go? I've got a little remote controlled car, it's the first of its kind because we're in the past, don't forget. I, I look at it and it gets so scared of me that it runs away. The world's first fear powered toy. You're walking away from me. That's a bush, not another one. It would have come up on my indicator if it was another one. I'm just scared of bushes. Is it? Are you roll away? No, well, it's it's. I don't know that I needed that. Right. Good Let job. you out. No. Good job, I'm here. It's roll. <laughs> oh, I don't believe it. Right. Rule of threes: never kidnap more than three merchants. That's my rule for life. And presumably, where the. Are you not going to follow me at all? Are you not going to be like coming with me? Thank you. What was wrong with you the first time? Are you going to save me? You dick mischief. Right. Where did I leave the rest of you? They were just on this road, right? There's the second one. There's the second one we found. His name's Kaplurpinsk. Obviously. You can tell. You can just sort of tell. Where's... Why have you... Is there like a brief moment as they're leaving the shed where they can't perceive you? It's us, the financial twins. We're here to make it worse. <laughs> Just make your experiences universally worse. You're here, hello. Three merchants. Three merchants will do ya. I don't wanna... Oh god. <laughs> They're gonna beat the shit out of me. Right, um, where's the... It's just... Oh, I'm, I'm, like, literally equidistant between two. Equally viable exits. I pick this one. It's my favourite. It's right in the middle of my where I went and got all of you. Are you all here? <laughs> God, that fucks me up. It fucks me up to look at them all. In a way that looking at multiple like soldiers doesn't. Phew. You expect them to oh, be in uniform. You expect them to look at least somewhat similar. But the, the fanboys of coin merchantry. Not so much. Oh, that could have gotten nasty, couldn't it? Oh, we've got so many coins. We've got so many coins from doing that. Did we pick up any... We picked up an empty bottle. That's good. I had one stolen at some point. But add these all together. And add them all apart. Right, long grappling hook. Hey! We love that! We love a long length of rope with a thing attached to the end of it for to gain purchase on distant surfaces to which you may wish to transport yourself. I can sell that back for a depressingly small amount of money. Well, a hundred's not nothing. Nowhere near what they're eventually going to sell it for again, but, you know, it's... That's the way we read the rights. I can only afford one of these, really. Go for the knockout ones. I got this horrible feeling that I can't even do anything with that. It's like... Oh, well, if I couldn't do anything with that, then this is the opposite of that, so I should be able to now. Yes. I can add to Sleepy Joseph. I can make more sleeps. That's brilliant. Protecting secret documents is considered trivial for someone of our talents now. That's fantastic. We're really swinging up in the world. We found Tarzan's big vine that he uses and he swoops up in the way. Ooh -hoo! We go! Ninja! Save my, Save my wiggly hand! Just keep quiet. 
There's coins on the floor. I want the coins. That's loose change for me. And I shall change nothing by stealing it. Yay. That's my money, thank you. Ooh. <laughs> Fucking sizing me up. Like, hmm, you think yourself worthy of the coins, hmm? I'm the coin boy, big boy, coin boy. <laughs> Hello. You, you came in through the door, but you'll leave through the fuck. The fuck's where we put the dead out. So you're aware. <laughs> well, I... To be fair, I do think that could be classified as leaving through the fuck. I certainly think I've kept my... What are you being startled by? Anything? Are we, are we fine? Oh, oh, no, don't put a fucking door on me. Oh. I don't... I don't fucking believe you. You've slid a pineapple under my shower door. I was... Don't target men who I'm trying not to get dead. I'm holding an axe. I thought somebody gave me a present, but, well, I missed. <laughs> I missed while trying to kill- I don't like- like, it gives me the flash, like, you could do this, and then it never works. <laughs> it works maybe two times out of every 18. Kicking a man while he's- Are you alright? He's trying to get in through the fuck! <laughs> what, what is wrong with this building and its fuck apart menu items? I've never seen anything like it, as long as I throw this- over there. Please, please move out of the way so I can continue doing what I want. <laughs> Whatever I want. Whatever I want. Whoever I stab. Please be dead. Please be dead. Please be dead. Whatever you do. Hey, there's one. We got that to work. Not you, thank you. The, the dead one. The dead one here. This absolute fucking chumpster. Your your chumptastic fungal fire. Oh, you <laughs> you just thought you did a forward roll. I oh, hello, it's me. <laughs> I'll give you something to invest in. <laughs> I'm. I'm a very. I'm a. In, in spite of the general uselessness of doing this at all, I'm in a very, I'm in a very sort of fun, very funny mood right now. Even though everything, even though everything's sort of scrumpling on, we persist. You're an axe at an angle. That's for where you. <laughs> you is not an answer to the question where. I don't think. But. You know, what if one, what if one day, what if one day it is? I'm simply preparing for that eventuality. I'm preparing myself for the moment when you become the country. In the next episode of Britain's An Actual Man. <laughs> we're, we're redoing the country from scratch and what we reckon would be good is if it was a bloke. So that we could have our own, like, Uncle Sam-type figure. But our one's real. Our one's, like, provably real. You're walking on him. You, know, you ain't walking on Sam, are you? Nah. You're mostly walking on Gravel. Gravel's not even a name. Call your child Gravel right now to prove me wrong. Do it, you won't. You're not that brave, are you? You're not that brave to effectively ruin your child's life. Is there like anything? I'm not buying. You can you can put it as cheap as you want. I don't need that. I don't need a strength sphere or another better shuriken. I don't. I can't think of a situation where I would particularly need a landmine. <laughs> An invisible weak landmine, aren't you, Nav? But, yeah, there's gotta be a use for him. 
another pot. I don't. I sort of. I'm buying all these pots on the assumption that I'll eventually find a use for them. But, but I don't think I needed this many pots. I'll be honest. I'm just like, what if? What if one day I need a skyless pot? You know. That'll do. That'll do for a name, won't it? There we go. Get get one of those down here. Do I want to dump a bunch of these otherwise useless even weeds into it? <laughs> I can't. I can't really think of a reason I would want to even the values out. But I I may eventually need to pour things into things. So. What if I oh, and then you see? Except except I still don't have enough ingredients. You can't pour like four worth of something into another pot. I could pour Sleepy Joseph into Wind Waker HD, potentially. Should I, should I do that? But then, but then I'm putting people to sleep with Wind Waker HD and the, the Sleepy Joseph now no longer. It's a meaningless accolade. That that amuses me to think about, actually. Oh, I guess I need at least ten. Well, Joseph's safe in his pot for another year. I actually think Amnesia might... I, want, I might want to start, like, using Amnesia at some point. Because I think, like, the guy just sort of forgot I was an enemy of his one time. And just and so I could just run up to him and stealth kill him and he'd be none the wiser. So, like, really... Maybe this... maybe this does go in the soup. Maybe this does go in the soup after all. I'll make the soup sphere. How about... I'll, I'll test drive... one of them. And then we'll we'll see how sort of useful that is. Oh no, the cat's gonna be like the next I'll probably be in the next world like and already fade away. Since leaving my aging mother and my wife and children to pursue a life of an aesthetic, I'd always known that I'd be bad. But I never think I'd be a snoofus. Oh dear. I might not be in this position, but I go ha ha ha. Mm. I'm mostly feeling sympathy for the guy because he is a cat, <laughs> to be to be completely honest. So, I mean, the cat's gonna be fine. The cat's just gonna forget that they were possessed. Anyway, you get a final special move. What's your final special move then? What's your final lovely th My thing? Sadame, I, your swordmaster, bring you a new move. I love to stab things. Look at me. What's this? What? Go up. Oh. You got me. <laughs> oh no. It was so effective that you paralyzed me. You cut them like this and then they can't fucking move near the statue. All we've got to do is move them near a statue and then. Sedane, don't build up your military. For Pete's sake. <laughs> You're in the. You're in the worst rat factory anybody's ever had. Oh wait, we directly contributed to the military build-up, didn't we? Oh, I, 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 hadn't, I hadn't thought about that. Another rice ro I don't want to just do the- I don't want to hurt Ichijo again. Uh, I do provisions. We can assassinate a bear! We've not assassinated a bear yet. Alright. What I'm gonna do- well, actually, I'll save first, just in case all fuck breaks fuck. So, we're changing the order of things. It's so that Akame doesn't get in a strop with me, I'm gonna send him a present. A salmon? No, not a salmon. Um... I can't remember if I've sent this to him already, and if, like, duplicate presents get you, like, a minus one. But a minus one's not a minus three. So... This'll, like, at, at worst, this'll mitigate what I'm afraid will happen. 
so I'll send that to you as an apology for not taking your mission next. And now I have forgotten to take the fish, first of all, that was, like, integral to my hole. It's, it's integral to my hole. Right, let's divide... Divide the fish like Jesus before us. And throw it at somebody. Put a fish in my pocket there. That's... Oh, I've accidentally uh, gotten rid of that. I didn't intend to. Right. Anyway, let's go and look at a bear. This'll be a great opportunity to learn all sorts of secret techniques to do with resetting your password. By which I mean there's going to be a lot of plants and mushrooms on the floor for me to have. So I'm going to use this also as a stocking up opportunity. Who are you, dickhead? Dickhead28. You... If I get... I'm helping you hunt a bear. <laughs> why is it, why in this scenario are you like enemies? Tell your men I'm gonna hunt the bear. <laughs> this is this is appalling organization. You're expecting me to be able to fight a bear quietly? I mean, I suppose getting noticed by your men is not gonna, like, decrease my trust with you. Cause, like, you gave me this mission. So it doesn't matter from, like, a... ...percentage... ...of trust standpoint. It's more just that... ...they're gonna try and fight me. And I'm... ...a little bit pissed off. Because of that, it just seems Any so avoidable. Where's the snoofers? <laughs> Off he snoofs. Right. A schmumbly little schmoopo. Um, you don't... you don't have to know that I'm here. Oh. These look good. Oh, you noticed someone else entirely. Any rations going? That bear's looking at someone else, thinking, oh, I'll have them. Oh, a lovely time for me to maybe steal from you. He's fallen downstairs. Can I just let you resolve each other? Wait, where can I... Working off fling the fish. FISH! Alright. Now when you get the fish, I... Get a wish! Stop you from having it, mate! Roar. Alright, we're gonna eat a bear tonight. In an, uh, in an emergency. Mistakes. <sighs> It's all you really needed a fish to do. I can I can confirm that uh, without doing that, fighting a bear is significantly harder. So it's just as well we had two fish on standby, isn't it? All right, we're working fast. Uh, Blurkus, Blurkus for our soul's sake. What do I need you? All oh, the unknowing is really getting up there. We're really getting on. This is a superior herb, I'll tell you fucking what. You mostly like to explode. Or to heal. Get you up to a lovely 80 that we can do. I'm going to bake you as well. Alright, that's more or less exactly what I wanted. I'll make a couple of powerful unknowing spheres just in case I need any more. Because you are getting to the point, my friend. Do I have, like, a plus three? Oh! Yes, please. We're getting sevens. Oh, we're getting sevens, though. I'm only looking for a plus three. 
Oh, lovely, we can get the batch up to a 90. 90, 90 batches. Sleepy Joseph! Right, let's, let's defend the garden and close out. I hope, given the amount of alchemy I've just done, because I've got a policy, I've got a policy now of not saving after, like when I know I have to go into the garden because of what happened last time. I'm really concerned now that <laughs> that I, if it does crash, that's a lot of mushrooms I've got to repurchase. But oh well, oh well, Ethan, isn't it? Oh Wellington boots. You always know how to make me smile. These shoes are so funny! I fell over. Where? Oh, you're... You're the fucking Kenobi. The Kenobi are coming in. That's a cock assing shame. That's... You're, you're ignoring my entire garden. Apparently, they... The enemies learn the layout of your garden, so it's actually advisable to change it every so often. I can't be bothered. So we're just gonna see what the Kenobi wanna do about the garden I have. Oh, this is a lot of them though. This is a lot of just fucking Kenobis all up and down. Have you killed my Yojin bow? Have you have you killed Jimbo the? F no, he's just far away. That's okay. He's not dead. He's just really far away. That's fine then. Yes, cut him. He go he goes through them like a hot knife through all of these men <laughs> that he needs to kill. So that's oh, you're like almost dead though. You're like having a bad day. Mushroom for me. You're, you're here, still. You're, we're still all here. What have I even done to the Kenobi recently to have prompted this? To have prompted them to get me. No. I don't like being weak. You've made me weak in my own garden. And I... I think it's fine to not do that sometimes. Oh, oh, oh. Please. Die in the pond! I can't believe I'm having to throw shuriken at you. Just to stop you from stealing a mushroom. It's not what I want to use this shit on. But I, f I fear losing all my good stuff. And if I can spend a lovely knife or two to prevent that, then I of course shall do so. Oh. Somebody died in the air. <laughs> you got an arm on you. That's big. <laughs> That's a big shape. Can I like... Oh, where's it gone? <laughs> Wait, was that like an item that I now have? Did, did that go in my pocket? What's going on? Look at my knee for a bit. Why don't you? There's no large shuriken in my pocket, it doesn't look like. I don't know then. I don't know where that went. It would it just evaporated in my hand. But um Well, we'll we'll evaporate in something else next time, so tune in for that. Goodbye. Oh Blumby Sklumpo.